Good evening and welcome to Eckstein's Curriculum Night 2022. My name is Kristen Rose and I'm the principal of Eckstein Middle School. We are so happy to have you with us this year in person for our event. As you know, the past two years have been done virtually, so it's a real pleasure to have our parents back in the hallways um, exploring their student schedules with us this year. Tonight is all about meeting your students' teachers, learning about the curriculum and the general scope for the year. Uh, you're gonna also get a sense of the busyness of your students' day as they walk from class to class um, that you will be able to do tonight as you go to all periods of your students' day. So again, we welcome you to Eckstein Middle School. Have a great evening. Our administrative team will be out and about tonight and helping you find your way to all six of your students' classes. Have a good evening. Go Eagles. Hi, welcome to Curriculum Night. My name is Jolene Anderson, and I'm one of the assistant principals here at Eckstein. I'm also the eighth grade house administrator. My counterpart, Brian Manzo, is the eighth grade counselor. So I wanted to talk about what's on the top of my mind right now, which is Camp Orkyla. All eighth graders are invited to participate regardless of their ability to pay. So if you're a parent that would want your kid to go, that maybe you just need to apply for scholarship, please let myself know or Mr. Manzo. If you're a family that would like to offer additional money to allow other students to be able to participate, that's highly encouraged as well. So during the camp, it will be October 19th through the 21st, and students will have all sorts of different activities and electives. We have, bon uh, we have a bonfire and scavenger hunt. It's just a great time. I've gone about four different times, and it's different every time and super great. To make that happen, we need 37 chaperones, as this will be the biggest group we've ever taken to Camp Orkyla. So far, we only have 21. If we don't get 37 chaperones, we have to cancel the trip, just due to district guidelines of 10 students for every one adult. So please, if you're interested, could you please contact the main office and ask for Julia Dietering. She is our volunteer coordinator. Or you can even email me at jaanderson at seattleschools.org. Thanks for being here tonight. Hey Eckstein parents, I'm Mr. Wires. I'm the sixth grade administrator and one of the assistant principals here at Eckstein. Um, I just wanna talk about this year and our sixth graders and how fantastic it has been seeing them transition into the middle school world. Um, I, it's been a really incredibly smooth transition and thank you for all your support and your communications. And if you have any questions, you can give me a call um, or send me an email. I'm here to help support our sixth graders and our sixth grade team. Thanks everyone. Hi everybody, my name is Berna Cristobal. I'm the seventh grade house administrator. I am new to Eckstein, but it's my 11th year in education. Um, um, something fun fact about me is that all my siblings and I have a similar name from our parents. And just wanted to remind parents and guardians that drop off is on 75th and pull up all the way there's a designated lane for you to pull up and drop off your kids safely thank you hi everyone i'm rima ziada the seventh grade counselor and this is my 22nd year here at Eckstein, and my 33rd year in education i started really young um, I'm here as a, as a school counselor. My role is to help kids be as happy and healthy as they can so they can do their job, which is learn at school. Um, counseling does academic counseling, um, social emotional counseling, career, and all of those together. So um, one of the things for academic and social emotional counseling we do is small groups sometimes focused on certain skills, focused on academic skills or social emotional skills. So your student may be involved in that if they and you uh, so choose. Hi everyone, I am Meredith Backtall and I am the sixth grade counselor this year. Um, throughout the school year, um, the counselors and our wellness department will facilitate um, some student needs and which will encompass um, social emotional, academic and college and career readiness uh, for student data. 
I'm Rima Ziada, sorry. I'm Rima Ziada, the seventh grade counselor. And one of the other things that we do in the counseling center, the wellness department, we hold small groups for students who have similar issues to support them. I'm Brian Manzo, eighth grade counselor, and our wellness department counselors social work all also support both formal and informal social emotional learning. Uh, and informal social emotional learning happens all the time around the building. And the more formal social emotional learning can be found this year in our Eagle News program, which comes out every Friday morning. And I'm Ms. Davenport, Eric Davenport, the social worker. So we all work together, but what I do um, that's a little bit different is supporting families with resources. So um, filling out free and reduced lunch applications, um, housing, food supports, uh, whatever your family may need, please come to me. Hi, I'm Joya Port and I am the Eckstein 8th grade English teacher as well as the leadership teacher and the activities coordinator. I run the ASB, which is student body government, and we make all of the fun happen at this school. So we do assemblies, Eagle Nights, which are dances, but more. We have movies, a bake sale, um, and usually some sort of game or activity going on. And then we also put on spirit weeks and all the fun that happens here. So reach out to me if you wanna volunteer. I'm definitely sure you're gonna get some uh, Sign Up Genius links for me. And um, we'd love to see you at some of our events. Thanks. Hi, my name is Enid Moore and I'm the school nurse here at Eckstein Middle School. I'm here to talk to you about how things work here in the office, particularly about dropping off medication. Uh, first and foremost, here we have to wear masks um, in the protecting in this healthcare room. Um, so anytime if your child needs to come, um, they they enter and I have masks at the door for them to use while they're here. We want to stay safe. Um, second, in terms of medication drop off. Uh, if you have a medication uh, that your child needs to take while here at school, whether that's an emergency medication like epinephrine or a medication they take every day, um, a few things that I need. First and foremost, the med needs to be in its original form, um, not a basic pill form that you put together, but the actual prescription bottle with the, um, your student's name and when it expires. I also need the authorization form from your physician telling me what the medication is and when it's to be given. So you would fill out the top portion to say whether this is a med that your student will carry with them, like albuterol for asthma, or whether it's a medication that will stay in the nurse's office, such as epinephrine um, or another uh, daily med. You would fill out the top and you would give it to your child's physician to fill out the bottom um, and sign it. I must have this in order to, for your child to get the medication here at school. Once you give me that, I will fill out, we will both fill out this medication receipt telling me what you've given me. And at the end of the school year, you'll get an email uh, around May, June to say, hey, before the end of school, um, I wanna give back your medication and we confirm that it was given to me on what, uh, September and I give it back to you. So that's it, we wanna be safe here. So I just need to make sure that all the I's are dotted and T's are crossed and we should have a great year here. So thank you very much. Hi, my name is Erin Sterling and I'm the librarian at Eckstein. I am so excited to have kids in the library this year. We have genrefied the library, so there are books organized by every single genre. I'm always purchasing books students want to read. I have a maker space where kids can make things. Um, I also have a TikTok and an Instagram account, which is at Eckstein Library, that you are welcome to follow, where I share book recommendations and suggestions and things that we've been doing in the library. Um, I can't wait to get to know you and your students. Have a great day. Hi, X9 Eagles. I'm Joanna Mencher, Miss Mencher. I'm the athletic director this year, and I wanted to welcome you all on our open house and let you know that in the fall, we have ultimate frisbee and girls soccer. In the winter, we have basketball. And then in the spring, we have boys soccer, girls volleyball, and co-ed track. Um, good luck to your student athletes this year, 
and you will very likely be encountering me if you're filling out paperwork for our athletics programs this year. Good luck, Eagles. Hi, my name is Jack Knight. I am the Prevention and Intervention Specialist here at X9. I started in November 2021, and I work in conjunction with the Eckstein Wellness Team. I also run a lunchtime program called Music Studio, where kids can come with their friends, hang out, listen to music, sing karaoke, learn to make beats, and learn something about maybe audio engineering or music production. Very nice to meet you. Mr. Knight, I'm um, school security on campus here uh, at Exxon Middle School. Uh, my job is to make sure that the school is safe, secure, and make sure that all kids and students are having a great time. Thank you so much. Hi, I'm Ms. Morgan in the main office, and I just wanted to give you guys a couple of reminders. For the safety of our students in school, during the school day, we ask that you not park in the back of the school. We are a secured building, so if you need to drop off your student or pick up your student or bring an item to the school, you must call 206-252-5010 and let us know which door at the front of the school you are at and someone will come greet you at that door. These doors remain locked, so a member of our office staff will come and greet you there. If you come and you do not have a phone with you, please just walk by the main office and wave at us and then we'll come greet you at those doors. Number two. Our ex at Eckstein, our cell phone policy is that they are to have their cell phones and earbuds away for the day. This includes during lunch and passing periods. Please help us with this policy and do not text or call your student on their cell phone during the day. If you need to get in touch with your student, please call the main office at 206-252-5010 and we'll help get a note to your student. Lastly, regarding early dismissals, whenever possible, please send an email to Eckstein.ms.attendance at Seattle Schools with an S dot org so that Miss Ryan in attendance can do a pass for your student to leave at the time you've requested. Then please call the attendance office at 206 252 5014 and we'll send your student out to meet you. Thank you so much for helping us plan ahead. It really does help our day go smoother. Hello, Eckstein Middle School. This is Ann Peterson reaching out to say hi. I am the administrative secretary and my main job is to support the principal, which in turn really means I'm here to support you. If you have any questions or need anything, please feel free to contact me. If I don't know the answer, I will find someone who can help you. Hi, my name is Julia Dietering and I am the Assistant Secretary at Exxon Middle School. I also handle volunteers. Please email me any of your questions. If I don't have the answer, I can find someone who does. Hi, I'm Katherine Ryan. I'm the Attendance Specialist here at Exxon Middle School, and I can be reached by calling the Exxon Attendance Line or email the Exxon Attendance email address. If you have any questions about your student's attendance, please don't hesitate to reach out to me. Hi, my name is Tony Morgan and I'm the data registrar here at Eckstein Middle School. My job is keeping records, looking at data, and maintaining teacher and student schedules. You might need my help for things such as schedule or address changes, getting transcripts, test scores, or sending your records off to high school after 8th grade. Email is the best way to get a hold of me, but you can reach out any way that works for you. Thank you and have a great school year. Hi, I'm Andrea Droffler, Fiscal Specialist for Eckstein Middle School. I do the supply purchasing, process all of the checks and cash that come in, and handle school pay. I urge you to set up a school pay account if you haven't already at www.schoolpay.com.